What is up guys, Kev PJ here man, back at it with another video. Mike Tyson? Jake Paul is fighting Mike Tyson? Are you serious right now man? I woke up and I saw it on Instagram, Jake Paul fighting Mike Tyson. And I was like, thinking to myself, is this guy dumb? Mike Tyson's old, right? We know Tyson's old. Jake Paul's young, but I don't know. I I see Mike Tyson winning this, but I really hope it's not rigged. I hope, you know, it's not rigged so Jake wins because, I mean, fighting like a legend like Mike Tyson, I mean, I just don't see Jake winning, to be honest. The only other person that I can see winning against Mike Tyson is myself, purely because I have trained all my life, and even though I don't, uh, you know, get in the ring and fight anyone. Like in my mind, I'm definitely one of those people, or the only person who can beat uh Mike Tyson. But anyway, let's see. Let's see what this video is all about, man. You heard it right, mother. I'm fighting Mike Tyson. I'm the best ever. You scared coward. Kick it, Mike. Praise be to Allah. The rematch is here. Oh my goodness, he's got a bloody right here. And not only do I have the honor of fighting one of the two most famous boxers to ever live, it's also happening live on that place. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. He just said live on Netflix. Live on Netflix. How? Has there anything? Has there ever been anything like that live on Netflix? So that does that mean you can turn on Netflix and then you can watch it on Netflix? That's crazy. Mike Tyson. You said the fight's gonna be on Netflix. What do you mean by that? Isn't isn't Netflix where you go to watch movies? It was until now. This is the first ever professional live sports event on Netflix. And with Netflix in over 500 million households and 260 million subscribers, we plan on this being the biggest fight of the 21st century, dummy. Who is putting on this event and where will the match be held? Well, it's our most valuable promotions event. My first time fighting in the stadium, Dallas, Texas. Oh, you're mad at me for fighting Mike Tyson? Imagine this. Jake, we got the biggest deal ever. You versus Mike Tyson, live on Netflix. You're gonna entertain me. You know why? I, you know why I feel like this is happening? I feel like it's because no one really cared, to be honest, about Jake anymore. Like, after all his fights and stuff. And he even recently had another fight. I don't think much people were interested. Jake did want, win that fight as well, but I don't know. I saw a video. Someone made a fight. Um, someone made a video that you know, no one's really interested in Jake Paul and his fights anymore. So I feel like this is definitely a like a way to kind of like get so many more people watching him and so much more engagement with him because he was low key like you know no one really cared blah 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 and then all of a sudden Mike Tyson Netflix you know now all of a sudden bang bang millions of people are making unbelievable amount of money what do you think. Exactly. That's what I thought. July 20th. Be there. Good boy. Oh man, I can't wait for the night of the 20th. I'm gonna make you my girlfriend. I'm gonna make Mike my girlfriend. I'm gonna make sure you kiss me good with those big lips. You take into the ring a lot of rage. But you've also never been punched by the most dangerous man in history. Does it pose any problem to you? It's, it's a, a fight. fight. Whatever, Whatever happens, happens, happens. happens. You're no good for boxing. Fuck you, you punk-ass white boy! He crazy fighter pay! Putting woman's mighty on his pedestal! Look what I've done for this sport! You won't shit without me! I'll be watching on Netflix. I'm here, you're, you're gonna see. Yeah, you will be watching. Everyone's gonna be watching. No shit. I'm just so glad to have the honor to step in the ring with one of the most brutal and most vicious and most ruthless champions there's ever been. That's my style is impetuous. My defense is impregnable. He wants to rip your heart out. I want to eat his children. But on July 20th, I promise you, I'll come out 
victory. You know, Jake, honestly, this is a huge fight. I got to give it to you. The way you're blending two generations of Shut boxing. Shut the fuck up. I wish you had kids so I could stomp on their testicles. Stomp on their testicles. It's a bit corny. What? It's a bit corny, I can't lie. It is a bit corny, this whole uh, promotion thingy. Look, I know I don't have any hate for Jake. I actually used to watch a lot of Logan Paul and Jake Paul videos back in, uh, you know, back in high, high school. When was that? Like, a few years ago? Like, I would wake up every morning and I would actually watch Logan Paul's videos, his daily vlogs. I know you all remember his daily vlogs. They were actually decent. And yeah, I, I actually watched them. But now, I don't know, man. They're a lot of exposing videos about them. Mainly Logan Paul, not Jake. Jake's kind of actually turned into more of a better person. Meanwhile, Logan Paul is, you know, still not that good. But yeah. What? Have a nice fight, Jake. F*** off. Go off. Jake, why do you have to talk like that? Well, I'm, I'm talking, talking to you the way I want to talk to you. You, you don't have like a problem, it, turn off this station. And once I found out the fight was on, I had to tell my family members that Mike Tyson signed the contract, big boy. He signed the contract. Hi. What the fuck? Is that on your face? <laughs> hey, did I tell you that I'm fighting Mike Tyson? Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm gonna fight Mike Tyson on Netflix. Wow. Yeah. I fucking yeah, do it. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I fucking do it. Oh my god! No oh, way! Man. You gotta ease your ears. Gotta say the sorry. <laughs> I can't believe it. that was Nina's first question. What if he eats your ears? Wow! Fucking wow. We back in Dallas. Where, <laughs> did you ever think a million years could happen? No. <laughs> just no, just absolutely not. Growing up, who was your favorite boxer? Mike Tyson. Mike, right? Fuck yeah. Why yes? <laughs> Cause um, I'm going to be fighting him. No way. In July. Dude. On Netflix. Are you fucking kidding me, Dad? Yeah. He's gonna be the hardest hitting motherfucker you ever fought. I know. <laughs> Dude, holy fuck, I'm gonna be freaking out. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like he's training. Like he's like, he is. Damn. He's like training for him. So. Do you see that? Not as fast as me, but still. That little clip of him, he looks so, like, agile for his age, man. Damn. Dude, is this real? <laughs> is this fucking happening for real? <laughs> yeah. You swear to God, bro? <laughs> yeah. What the fuck, dude? Dude, let's fucking go. Is this real or are you bullshit? Dude? This is real. Is this on Netflix? <laughs> dude, this is fake. Bro, are you fucking changing the game? Bro, let's fucking go. God, you fucking, I, still have, I don't know if you're pranking me right uh, now. It's real, it's real. Okay, okay, stop right there. Everyone just kept on asking me, including my mom, why would you step into the ring with Iron Mike Tyson? He's going to kill you and knock you out. Well, it all started four years ago when I met Mike Tyson at his ranch. And we're here, Tyson Ranch. About to meet the legend. We're a little nervous, you know? I've watched Mike growing up. So, uh, this is cool. It's cool to be here. Look at this, bro. These are Mike Tyson's gloves right here. Jeez, these are the ones I think in the video where you're just eating people alive. How much do you think we could sell these for? <laughs> <laughs> so am I scoring Mike next or? Huh? Yeah. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> you ready to think on Mike? No, 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 sir. Yeah. I'll play Mike in chess. Or something that doesn't involve physical contact. It was all going great. I was meeting my childhood hero. Can we just talk about like his house real quick? Look at that house, bro. How crazy is that? That looks really beautiful. It's got a pool. It looks like he's right by a beach wow i would love to take a tour of that house i do like houses and the insides of houses and what they look like i really want to go inside it i really want to see what's inside it for the first time what's up mike hey Rob. how are you mars loved it huh? good to meet you and then he said this. He's from Logan. 
Uh, I'm Jake. I'm Jake. Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. That, that's actually funny. <laughs> I mean, people, imagine meeting your childhood hero for the first time and they call you your brother's name. We don't even fucking look alike. And ever since that day, <laughs> ever since that day, Mike, <laughs> I've wanted to knock you the fuck out. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, in all seriousness, fighting Mike Tyson is such an honor to step in the ring with one of the two most famous people to ever grace the sport of boxing. Not only will this be the biggest fight of my life, but I think this has the opportunity to change the history of boxing to be one of the biggest fights of the 21st century and to step in there with a legend means the world to me. It's the biggest moment of my career and a big challenge. Everyone I've told so far has said, don't get in the ring with Mike. He's too hard of a puncher. I mean, just look at this footage. That man is a beast. That's scary. That's scary. I mean, for him, that's scary. Not for me, but that's scary for Jake. The fact that he's moving like that. Hey, you know what? Respect to Jake. He's actually taking this um seriously and he's, you know, giving props to Mike. He's not being like, Dumb or an idiot, which is actually, I respect Jake for that. But I'm not taking him lightly. And July 20th, I hope to become the victor and to create history and knock out the legendary Iron Mike Tyson. David Paul, he keeps saying he wants to fight you. Do you want to fight him? That could be very interesting. It could be interesting. Mike Tyson says, let's do this. Are you down? 100%. Tyson versus that Jake might Paul be the would way. be the best fight fucking ever. How would you feel if you stepped into the ring with Iron Mike? I would be in. Could you fuck him up? Oh, I'm so fucking easy. You versus Jake Paul, like this young YouTuber, takes on one of the greatest heavyweight champions that's ever lived. I'm the best ever. That fight would be gigantic. Good. Let's do it, Jakey. Jake Paul. He's taking on the baddest motherfucker that ever lived. If Jake Paul is on the other side of the ring, he's gonna have a recognition. Yet. He's gonna look over and go, "Oh my god, that's really Mike Tyson." Yet. I have one punch power. He has one punch power. Who wins? I. <clears throat> Here's the thing. You know what's always gonna be interesting is that Mike Tyson. Let me let me switch up how old Mike Tyson is. I actually don't know how old Mike Tyson is. Because the fact that Mike Tyson is, like, really old, that's obviously a disadvantage. Like, he's 57? I mean, look, there's obviously there's nothing wrong with age in that. I mean, there is. But <clears throat> if you put both these guys in their primes, we already know Mike Tyson will win. But the fact that, you know, when you get older, especially in your 60s, you know, your body starts to let you down, right? There's only so much you can do. So, this, I don't see this as a fair fight, to be honest. Like, Jake has his youth, Tyson's getting old. Even though the footage that we saw of Tyson was really impressive. I mean, oh, I'm going to be rooting for Mike Tyson. Um, If Jake somehow does win, it will be one of the most insane things to ever happen really and i'm actually excited to see it because it's on netflix that's really intriguing to me live on netflix that is really intriguing so i'm gonna be staying tuned for that and um yeah maybe i can <clears throat> unfortunately you know tyson won't be fighting me if he was you know i'd be winning that no questions asked obviously um but yeah he's versing jake and let's see if jake can Handle the pressure and up to the task. Subscribe if you're new, man. Trying to hit 1,000 subs? What? Let's go! Oh, un video mami gente para ver el tiempo en presente.